क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी इन अ बैंक प्रिंसिपल इंक्रीजेस कंटिन्यूसली एट द रेट ऑफ आर परसेंट पर ईयर फाइन द वैल्यू ऑफ आर इफ रुपीज हंड्रेड इज डबल इट सेल्फ इन टेन ईयर्स एंड दे गिवन द वैल्यू ऑफ लॉक टू विच विल बी यूजिंग दे हैथ सेड द प्रिंसिपल सपोज आई टेक दैट एज पी इज इंक्रीजिंग एट द रेट ऑफ आर परसेंट पर ईयर सो रेट ऑफ इंक्रीज ऑफ प्रिंसिपल will be represented as dp by dt is r percent r upon 100 obviously of p jitna principal hai usna wo r percent se increase ho raha hai okay so this is what is given to us that dp upon dt rate of change of principal is r upon 100 into p okay so then again we'll do variable separable form we had dp here this p will be taken to left hand side so 1 upon p dp and r will be constant rate remains constant okay so r is actually an arbitrary constant out here so r upon 100 dt if you integrate this becomes log of p that was a constant and this will give you a t out here now we need to find this for which we were given that principal first was 100 later it becomes 200 and initially me time is always to be taken as 0 and uh, second case time was given t as 10 Okay, so in the first case, we'll take log of hundred. P was hundred rupees hundred. That time T will be taken as zero, so that will help you find your C as log hundred. Okay. In the second go, when doubling means now it will become two hundred. It was doubled. They had said so. If principal is two hundred, that happens after ten years. So in the same, now you put your T as ten, P as two hundred. And we had already evaluated our C. C came out to be log hundred. Put that value as well to find our R uh, from here. So uh, log hundred and log two hundred. If I take this to the other side, it will become log two hundred minus log hundred, which is log of two hundred upon hundred, right? So we'll be left with only log two, log key properties, right? And then here your ten percent would cancel out to give leave you uh, with a ten in denominator here, which will on cross multiplying is giving me ten log two, which was value of log two given as zero point six nine three one. So your rate finally becomes six point nine three one. Okay. Similar is your next question, children. In a bank, again, principal is increasing continuously at the rate of five percent per annum. Your house may R be. You have to evaluate. Karna tha. Work made easy here. You already know your constant rate as five, and uh, an amount of rupees thousand is deposited in this bank. How much will uh, it worth after ten years? So, is question me the amount pata the in both the cases. Initially, it was hundred. Later, it became two hundred. So, initially, we take t as zero, and later t was given as ten. Yaha apka principal uh, has to be taken out in the second case. Okay. So, when t is zero, p will be taken as thousand. When t is ten, what will be p? So, pehle ap waise equation banaoge. And first condition से अपना constant of integration निकालोगे. Second में if you put t as 10, value of p that you get will be corresponding to your answer. And for there maybe somewhere this expression is coming e to the power of 0.5 which you will replace by 1.648. Okay? So you will try this one on your own. 22nd, uh, there is a culture in which bacteria count is initially one lakh. The number is increased uh, by 10 percent in every two hours. Okay, rate of increase. यहाँ पे भी आपको mentioned है. 10 percent fix given है. How many hours will the count reach two lakh? Again, you have to find time in the second case. Okay, T you have to find. If the rate of growth of bacteria is proportional to the number uh, present, the rate of growth of bacteria is proportional to the number of bacteria. So, if suppose I say that x denotes the number of bacteria at any instant t or at any time t, then the rate of increase of bacteria, that is dx by dt, is said to be proportional to number of bacteria. So number of bacteria we had said is x. So this is what is given to you. Rate of change of bacteria or increase of bacteria is equal to is not equal to sorry proportional to. It is proportional to. So जब ये proportionality हटती है when you put constant of integration, then uh, when you remove the uh, proportionality and you put equality, then you have a constant of integ uh, uh, constant of uh, 
प्रपोर्शनैलिटी वी कॉल इट ओके वो फिजिक्स में पढ़ा होगा आपने राइट सो दैट इज वाई दिस विल एंड अप गिविंग यू डी एक्स बाई इट इज इक्वल टू सम के टाइम्स एक्स अगेन वील सेपरेट द वेरेबल सो वन बाई एक्स डी एक्स एंड के टाइम्स डी टी इंटीग्रेटिंग लॉग ऑफ एक्स इज वंस अगेन इक्वल टू के टी प्लस सी नाउ वील इवेल्युएट ऑल दीज अनोन्स सी के सब हमारे अनोन्स हैं सो फॉर दैट वेन टी वॉज जीरो इनिशियली इनिशियली मे टी इज ऑलवेज जीरो देन वी हैव वन लैख था हमारा अकाउंट सो यूजिंग दैट आई कुड इवेल्युएट माई कॉन्स्टेंट ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन सी ओके पुटिंग दिस लॉग ऑफ वन लैख आई हैव टू रिटर्न इट इन शॉर्ट फॉर्म टेन टू द पावर ऑफ फाइव ओके और वी कैन राइट इज फाइव लॉग टेन कम्स टू द सेम और वन फॉलोड बाई फाइव जीरो वॉट एवर एंड टी वॉज जीरो सो वी कैन इवेल्युएट आर सी फ्रॉम हियर नाउ वी ऑल्सो हैव टू फाइंड दिस केस सो फॉर दैट मोर फैक्ट्स वर गिवन टू अस एंड दोज वर we were told that uh, 10% is increase shown in 2 hours so initially hamare 1 lakh the count okay so 1 lakh ka 10% 10% of 1 lakh means 10000 itna increase ho gaya so after 2 hours count kitna ho jayega after 2 hours 1 lakh plus increase so 1 lakh 10000 this is the value of x after at t is equal to 2 so इन द नेक्स्ट को सेम हमारा ये जो इक्वेजन आया था अब इसमें अगर मैं यहाँ पे एक्स काउंट की जगह रखती हूँ वन लैख टेन थाउजेंड दैट वॉज वेन माई टी वॉज टू आफ्टर टू मिनट आर्स ओके एंड कॉन्स्टेंट ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन वी हैड इवेल्युएटेड दैट ऑल्सो विल पुट हियर दिस विल हेल्प अस फाइंड आ के ओके सो इसका बेटा एक्सपेंशन कर लेना इट्स अप टू यू या तो आप इसे ब्रेक कर लो यू कैन राइट दिस एज लॉग इलेवन इन टू लॉग ऑफ टेन टू द पावर ऑफ फोर ऐसा कर लो या इसको इसको इधर ले आओ यू कैन एडजस्ट बाय योर सेल्फ सो इफ यू ब्रिंग दिस दिस साइड एंड एक्सपैंड इट देन दिस वुड बी लॉग ऑफ वन लैख सो इट वुड बी लॉग ऑफ ए अपॉन बी माइनस साइन की वजह से सो इल वन वन इलेवन फॉलोड बाय फोर जीरोज अपॉन वन फॉलोड बाय फाइव जीरोज जीरोज फोर जीरोज गेट कैंसल एंड यूर लेफ्ट विद ओनली इलेवन अपॉन टेन एंड दिस टू विल गो टू दी अदर साइड विल कम एज हाफ दिस वॉज वी वर इवेल्युएटिंग अ के सो वीव गॉट अ के इज वैल्यू एज हाफ लॉग इलेवन अपॉन टेन ओके तो सब सिस्टमेटिक एंड लॉजिकल हैं इट्स ओनली थोड़ा कैलकुलेशन ज्यादा है तो If you don't focus, you might get confused, but it's simple enough. Okay, so we've got our value of c. We have already got it. The other one, our k arbitrary constant unknown was that also we have evaluated. Put both these values in the uh, general equation that we had got. K ki value bhi put kar loge ab, c ki bhi kar loge. Now coming to our final question, where they had asked us ki what would be the time when count would be two lakh now. Okay, so ab x ki jagah two lakh aa jayegi value. okay so your x is 2 lakh and then t is what you have to find so log of 2 lakh is equal to ye hamara k tha t hame evaluate karna hai ye hamara c tha ab ye calculation aap karoge so again here your 10 to the power of 5 10 to the power of 5 ka log can balance ho ja raha hai you only left with log to this side okay log of a into b is log a plus log b to so ye log b log b aapke balance ho ja rahe hain so log 2 this half has been cross multiplied so 2 log 2 and this has to be taken to denominator because our question was to evaluate t so the time is this much all right uh, then i think last one is very simple you must have done it by now 